Yo, what is up? What is going on today? Another episode of Stay Smooth Shaven with your host, Day Smooth, on this glorious Saturday today. Hope you're doing great. Hope you're having a great day. Hope you started your day with an awesome shave to get things rolling. Boom. Doing it big, doing it great. Today we're going to do a nice shave with an awesome shaving soap that I believe a lot of you have. But this is the newest scent from PAA Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements, Inye. Now you know Inye. Inye! But when it first came out as an aftershave cologne with a different logo with a female on it. Very seductive. Change logos here. I don't know what you think. I like the old one. But hey, that's just me. The new one's nice too. But I gotta tell you, the scent is spot on. If you smell Inye aftershave cologne, the soap is spot on. And I just have to say, thank you, Mr. Douglas Smythe, for actually finally releasing the soap because I've got I've had your your aftershave for a long time and I was thinking man if I could just have a soap that would accompany that would help me get this scent to another level it would be the soap so thank you Douglas very good stuff they match great excellent now I'm just in the middle of my shave just about to do my third pass we all know about the performance of Phoenix. He's actually up the bar, I think, with the Crown King line. But this is a sad day. We all know that Phoenix is going to be discontinuing or actually scaling down its process of some of their soaps and scents. And only some are going to be um, seasonal, which is kind of a bummer. One of my favorites, IE, is going out. But I have some Dirty Cut Cake is going but I have the original Vanetiver I think me and Buster are the only ones that like Vanetiver um, but it's okay it's alright but I understand why things don't move things don't you know gotta have stuff in stock I understand that but it is a sad day nonetheless anyway to finish our shave oh man and this scent is just permeated my bathroom. Once again, the workhorse of my tin, the 34CHD. And I have it today in the Plasson, doing big things. Gonna go to a face lather here. And we all know that Phoenix has got great properties. They've refined the soap so many times. That I love every reincarnation of this soap, but this soap has got great properties for slickness, cushion glide. It's not as quite as good as post shave as the newer soaps have come to be, but I think that's where Crown King comes in. And this stuff is just freaking great. Paints on just freaking nice. Excuse me. Gonna do our third pass today with the NA with hashtag PAA, hashtag stay smooth, hashtag just do it, baby. Anyways, <laughs> back to the shave. Third pass against the grain. I have a fresh feather blade. And I've been trying to give Feather so many chances. And they're a sharp, nice blade, but they are just not smooth for me. Not smooth at all. They got some bite to them. Very nice, though. Loving this scent, Douglas. Excellent. A 
But yeah, some of our favorite scents are going to go away. Or just be seasonal, something like that, but I don't know. I'm just glad that I uh, got my favorites on hand. But nonetheless, they're going bye-bye. Very nice indeed. Do a little touch up right here. Pull some out of the brush there. Oh yeah. I normally don't do this much touch up, but I have to be really careful with the feather. So, I'd rather do light pressure and do it again. So that's what I'm gonna do. Very nice. Great scent. I say Phoenix is one of my favorite vegan soaps. Top performer. Indeed, sir. As they should. shave it just makes the day so much better so much more enjoyable great stuff compelling and rich anywho we can talk about this scent because if you haven't tried Enya you're gonna love it because it's got this woody I don't know cedar scent but it's got a fresh clean cologne scent it's very sensual the first time I wore the aftershave cologne. I can say I've got the most compliments, male and female, that I've ever gotten from another scent. Maybe it just matches well with my pH, that cedar and tonka bean, and it just smells fresh and earthy and woodsy, and it's nice. So I'm gonna let Douglas explain it how he did because <laughs> it's one of those things. So it's got a potent blend of orange essential oil, bergamot, tonka bean, cedar, as it stands on its own. And it says it's a steadfast cedar deep in the forest, but on the flip side, at the same time, it's fresh as a tropical sunrise on a relentless sea. What a poet. There you go. So you can't, basically have a more different dichotomy of scents in one bottle. It just is, um, I think it needs to be experienced. That Enya, that cedar and the tonka bean and it's great. It's got that men's cologne like you're wanting to do and the potency. This is very potent too. I'm gonna round out my shave today with the Thayer's. One of my favorite scents from PAA, from Phoenix. I'm glad they have accompanied it with the shave soap. Now we're gonna finish off the shave with the matching aftershave. I have the older bottle, but the newer bottles look like the uh, whiskey, you know, liquor bottles, but I kinda like this. Um, old style 
my throwback, an OG. So let's splash some of this greatness on. This stuff smells great. Oh yeah. And this stuff's strong too. I love my colognes and aftershaves, strong scented. I love my scents of my soaps. Very strong scented. That's just how I roll. That's just how I like my scents. And I know some vendors don't do it to keep down the sensitivity levels, but if I want to be smelled from the door, okay, here comes D. I smell him. I smell him coming in a good way. <laughs> Let's do this, shall we? Inye is $10.95. For 3.5 ounces, it comes to $3.12 per ounce. And if you know if you get the big 8 ounce, it drops it down under 2 something, I think, an ounce. But <clears throat> the aftershave is a little pricey, but you get, you know, you know what you're getting when you get in PEA, Phoenix. You're getting excellent stuff in there. I mean, stuff to hydrate your face, vitamin E, all that stuff. Um, so there you go. $24.95 for 3.5 ounces comes with $7.12 per ounce. I got all this stuff from Phoenix Artists and Accoutrements. Service 10. They get stuff here fast. I mean, the fastest I've had it was like within two days. I think this one took three days. So, great stuff. I don't know how else to explain Inye, but try it. You will not be just If you like that deep men's scent it's not a, a, a soft scent by any means so if you're looking for a softer scent it needs to be in your face and i like that because i'm in your face yeah. i'm just kidding yeah. but here we go we're gonna rate this bad boy we all know phoenix is performance is top notch for slickness it's it's nice it's a nine slickness is very good with uh, phoenix we got cushion cushions there it's about an 8.5 on cushion Great stuff. Post shave. Since I since I've been tinkering with the uh, avocado oils and coke and butters, uh, the post shave has been dropped down to maybe like a 7.9 post shave face fill. But uh, the scent on this is a 10 for me. I love it. I love this type of scent. Good job, Douglas. Thank you for making the soap. 10 scent strength. It's like an 8.5 of the soap. It's pretty strong. And I like that. Keep doing that, please. All around, right out the bat, I'm saying Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Inye gets an 8.9 on the Richter scale, sir. So there you go. Good job, Douglas. Love it. Doing it. Making things happen. 10 on scent. Big for me. Loving it. And this thing lasts five hours plus. So. I'll put some more on. Oh man. Smell it. Smell a vision. Wow. Good stuff today. Great shave. Hope you had a great time today. That's the show today on this Saturday. Hope you can join in next time. This shave was awesome. Sad to see some of the PAA scents go away, but it is what it is. We must move on. We must move forward, hence the future. And until next time, you respect yourself, respect the day, and respect others. And until next time, you stay smooth.